and welcome to FourCornersTV.com. I'm Ayla Quinn and this is the Local Roundup. The USA Pro Challenge wrapped up on Sunday in Denver with a nail-biting photo finish. Alex Howes from Boulder took the stage win, TJ Van Gardren, an Aspen resident, took the overall win, and Tom Danielson, a Fort Lewis alumnus, took second overall. Is the bright green manhole a new bike box? The random marking on 8th Street between Main and East 2nd has left Durangoans questioning. The green paint is just a workday utility marker. Red is the sign for electric, while blue is the indicator for water lines. Green happens to be the color of sewer infrastructures. While green markings are popping up on Main, golfers hitting the greens have to overcome the smell. Golfers and residents of Dalton Ranch are noticing a pungent odor. The smell is not a new thing, but different temperatures can affect the odor, bringing organic matter to the surface of the sewer lagoons. For now, golfers will have to deal with the odious odor. We all know sewage can be highly flammable, but this week marks the celebration that concludes with the ultimate inferno. Burning Man kicks off today in Nevada's Black Rock Desert. This celebration brings together those who cherish individualism, self-reliance, and community. The community of Black Rock City balloons to 60,000 people with roads, restaurants, a post office, volunteer police departments, and much, much more. But one main principle is the idea of leaving no trace. After the celebration is over and the man burns, you'll never even know the celebration happened. Speaking of going up in flames, your travel plans may be going up in smoke. If you have plans to fly from Durango on Frontier Airlines, some flights are being canceled starting in October. So if you have made plans, check your flight status. This past weekend in Durango was filled with festivities. Rain or shine, apparently Durango will still be drinking beer. Yeah, beer! The San Juan Brewfest was a hit again this year, even when hit with a summer storm. 50 different breweries served up their best concoctions. Tune in at 3 p.m. to get all the highlights on In the Neighborhood. That's right here on FourCornersTV.com. And a reminder today that 9R starts school. Have a great school year to all you students and teachers and drivers beware. Thanks for watching the local roundup on FourCornersTV.com. I'm Ayla Quinn and we'll see you tomorrow.